in saying that we follow Paul in the instruction of grace that he gives us, does that mean then that we make too much of Paul or that we're following a man? Right? So if, if Paul's glorying through Jesus Christ and things that pertain to God, that he got from God, when we obey and follow Paul's instructions, are we then following Paul or are we following Jesus Christ? Right. Following Jesus Christ. Because right. it's Jesus Christ's word. Yes, Jesus Christ spoke some things in Matthew to John that most Bibles put in red. And that was the truth of God. He was confirming things to the fathers, just like the prophets had said. But that's not all that Jesus Christ ever said. I'm here to tell you that after Jesus Christ ascended back to the Father, repentance was offered to Israel, Jesus Christ spoke again to an apostle, which he gave some new information concerning grace and a purpose in long-suffering. And he said, go, preach that. Preach my word. And Paul will say that, you know, if a man is spiritual, let him acknowledge that the things I write unto you are the commandments of the Lord. They're the commandments of the Lord. And if a man can sit not to wholesome words, even the words of our Lord Jesus Christ, you know, he, he's proud and knowing nothing. That's right. He's following Jesus Christ's instructions in a ministry that was given to Paul to the Gentiles concerning the gospel of God, that that offering up might be acceptable and well-pleasing unto the Lord. So he says, I have therefore whereof I may glory through Jesus Christ and those things that we make.